Now, how do we uh, do this? No? And first, uh, and first, we draw uh, paying attention to any object. No? Quite simple, really. You know? uh, uh, we stop paying, paying attention to any object. Uh, we should not think about anything, uh, but remain like a stone or a piece of wood. No? You know, Shanti, there was a Buddhist, I want to say, you should remain as a piece of wood. It was many times he thought. Mm. So, like inanimate object, mm. uh, without uh, thinking or perceiving anything, we remain in this state for a few minutes. Like this, um, through applying effort and through determination. Uh, uh, determination. Mm. Because uh, we understand greatly uh, disadvantages of uh, distracting uh, concepts of thought, which is gross mind. Yeah. Gross mind. And this kind of practice even had ancient time non Buddhist had this also. Uh, they are uh, they, one of the their main practice, you know. Ancient, I don't know nowadays, so I don't know. Uh, for ancient history, even non Buddhist, many non Buddhist. Um, the practitioner also <coughs> concentrating because uh, they understand that this distracting mind causes so many problems. You know, uh, never allowed ourselves to remain peacefully, calm, enjoy life. Never allowed ourselves to enjoy our human life. You know, uh, we are like uh, 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 naked person who uh, in, on the torn uh, ground, you know. So that will move to the next problem, you know. <laughs> so this is detecting thought. So they have big renunciation. Uh, so they're uh, stopping and uh, paying uh, attention to any object, uh, and not thinking about any, uh, anything, forgetting everything, uh, remaining like uh, a piece of wood or strong, without thinking or perceiving anything. Uh, so we should do similar to <laughs> this. Uh, we remain in this state, you know, permanent, and uh, Learn this. Mm. So therefore, if you forget, then every problem stops. You know the problem is we never forget. You know this is the problem. You know. Uh, so also normally we our ordinary friends say forget, forget. You know when they uh, someone um, remembering bad things, then they are angry or say forget, forget. But uh, this is uh, giving advice. You know. So but reality, um, forgetting is difficult. You know. So, so we learn this. Uh, um, how to accomplish the cessation of gross mind, distraction mind. Practical learning. This is uh, temporarily very um, beneficial for to solve our uh, day by day problem, you know. Anger problem, attachment problem, jealous problem, worry, discouragement, disappointment, discontentment, so forth. Stop everything, forget, and nothing uh, peace. Mm. Remain like a piece of wood, uh, and, uh, mm, like an inanimate object. Mm. Because our regional motivation is to add enlightenment. For us, uh, mm, it's very good, you know. If there are regional, there are no animal motivation, it looks like sleeping, you know, mm, like sleeping. But our uh, um, aim, uh, main aim is to accomplish the um, uh, sixth stages. That is the 
uh, realizing um, our continually residing mind directly through this as an enlightenment. Through this, we want to benefit all living beings without exception. This is our main aim, you know. So therefore, to make progress in this aim, we, we're doing this. So therefore, our um, aim is uh, like Buddhism. So therefore, for us, it's um, a part of um, Buddhist practice. Um, so therefore, you mean like um, a piece of wood uh, without any thing, any piece, uh, any, any piece of anything piece of it. Um, in this way, we uh, experience the cessation of uh, all the gross mind. Um, <coughs> um, <coughs> Then, mm, mm, this is like basic. And we then try to perceive our subtle mind by contemplating. No? Pasi sees the gross mind, uh, uh, remain like a piece, ourselves, a piece of mind. Mm. In this way, we, we will uh, accomplish the cessation of all the gross mind. We then try to perceive our subtle mind by uh, contemplating. Uh, <clears throat> it is nature is uh, the cessation of all gross mind. Uh, it is function is to perceive an empty like space. And it is located it is our heart regions. So we uh, contemplate in our subtle mind, which uh, uh, possesses uh, three characteristics. A mind which possesses three characteristics. One is that it is nature, it is nature is the cessation of all gross mind. And two, uh, it is a function to perceive and empty like space. And the three, it is located, is located at our heart region. We contemplating uh, uh, three characteristics of our subtle mind. Uh, this is um, seeking, seeking. We are seeking to perceive clearly our subtle mind. We are seeking our, uh, and uh, we are seeking the object of our meditation. That is the, our subtle mind. And this is the practice of seeking. You know? When we are contemplating the three characteristics of our subtle mind, that is, uh, the, it is nature is the cessation of um, uh, all gross mind. It is a function, uh, two is the, it is function is to perceiving an empty like space. Three, it is located at our heart regions. We are contemplating to perceive uh, our object of meditation. That is the, our subtle mind. This is seeking, seeking. This practice of seeking, and this is the practice of seeking, not seeking. When through contemplating, in this way, we perceive uh, clearly the general uh, image of our subtle mind. We have found the object of our meditation. And that is the uh, clear appearance of our subtle mind. This is finding. So we, through contemplate, um, contemplating in this way, when we perceive our, uh, the general image um, of our subtle mind, uh, we have found our subtle mind, the object of our meditation. And this is pointing, pointing. You know? This means we now found the, our very subtle mind, which is the object of our meditation. Having found our object of our meditation, we then need to turn in holding it 
without forget, with, to learn. And we can do so, uh, can do so for about one minute. Mm. Part sitting and pounding, and then learn to hold him without forgetting about one minute. Uh, when we ability to hold it with, uh, in one minute, this is holding. Uh, and, uh, and then through continually repeating, uh, um, uh, through continually repeating the steps of seeking, finding, and holding. Uh, when our concentration is, um, remains uh, on it is object, uh, uh, that's on the subtle mind, for five minutes, um, we accomplish the fourth step remaining, you know. Uh, after holding accomplishment of holding, then we have to uh, learn to remain uh, past one minute, then two minutes, and then gradually five minutes have to turn to duration of remaining increasing through um, practicing again and again, um, just repeating. You know? mm. The more getting familiarity, then we our ability to remain increasing. You know, of course, this is nature. You know, with the familiarity, there's no any difficult thing. Anything. You know? uh, without familiarity, everything difficult. You know? with, without familiarity, everything difficult. Mm. With the familiarity, everything is easy. They said. They said they were said. You know. Mm. That's true. Mm. Mm. If I, I will ask you how to eat Tibetan Zamba, Tibetan Zamba Park, you have no familiarity, difficult to understand, you know. Mm. I will prepare implement to you all the necessary things for Zamba, butter, tea, everything, uh, cheese, dry cheese, and butter, everything food. Then please, please help. You cannot eat, you know? how to do this? Because no familiar. Mm. And with the familiarity, we can attain uh, enlightenment. Those who are checks but even sports, other particular, we can attain few months, few years with familiarity. Everything depends on familiarity. Familiarity depends to the practice. If you know practice, impossible, you know. Normally our engaging med meditation, why? Getting familiar, in order to get in familiarity, you know. Our normal uh, object of meditation is the object of attachment, you know. <laughs> Good. Because uh, we have deep familiarity, <laughs> which um, comes from the uh, um, uh, countless periods of life, so life after life past, you know, lineage, um, lineage, uh, experience, you know. Um, <laughs> um, even during retreat, uh, meditation, still you are sometimes thinking object of attachment, you know. Um, so they have, now is that to change, you know. Um, attachment is a distracting concept to talk. Uh, destroying our mental peace, destroying our happiness. You know? Without the peace of mind, there is no happiness. Uh, delusion such as anger, attachment, they are main function to destroy our inner peace, mental peace. They are our real enemy. Uh, person who have ability to control delusions, real hero or heroine. Uh, person who are uh, um, under the uh, delusions, no hero, heroine. No? Mm. So they are hero, hero, heroine are the people who have ability to control um, the main delusion, uh, uh, the main enemy of delusion. No? Mm. So anyway. Uh, familiarity, mm. and getting familiarity, uh, gradually increasing, remaining, uh, 
until uh, we can remain pure concentration or pure meditation on our very certain mind uh, per minute without pocket um, object, per minute. We accomplish the fourth step, uh, remaining, remaining. At this point, we accomplish the third stage, uh, of turning Imamudra, that is the identifying our own subtle mind, you know. 